Workers at a popular Midtown gym went public to complain about working conditions. Soon after, they were all fired. Brenda Ordonez is live with that story. Hi, Brenda. Thanks, Ophelia. While Midtown Athletic Club did not respond to my request for comment, those who did were ex-staffers who tell me they feel humiliated and useless after the luxury fitness club outsourced their positions in a move they believe was retaliatory. Over 30 workers are out of a job after Midtown Athletic Club fired its entire housekeeping staff. The first notice they gave us that they were outsourcing our positions effective May 1st was on March 23rd. The second notice, where they told us they were firing us effective immediately, was on April 13th. In the email, Midtown Athletic Club stated that the abrupt dismissal was due to the club's plan to expedite its transition to a third-party housekeeping team. But ex-staffers believe that this dismissal was in retaliation for them speaking out about poor working conditions. I have co-workers that would find needles and we had nowhere to safely throw them away. We would find towels with blood and they would tell us just throw it away anywhere. Workers tell me that these conditions persisted for years, which was why in September they chose to seek outside counsel with Arise Chicago, an organization that helps non-unionized workers organize. When we were first talking to these workers, you know, sure, you know, here and there they were raising the concept of a union. They liked the idea of being able to come together and bargain collectively with their employer, but their big focus was around democratizing their workplace. With the Rise Chicago support, ex-staffers were putting more pressure on the gym to better their working conditions in the months leading up to their dismissal. But ex-staffers say nothing ever changed. Regardless, these workers say they are not done fighting for their jobs. We love our job and we want to return to our job. In Bucktown, I'm Brenda Ordonez, Chicago This Week.